Hello everyone. Welcome back to PDMS for Beginner. This is Mr. Tan. Have a good day. Today we will talk about how to modeling pipe from an XREF. First of all we will open the file A47 piping have done before. We type the command XREF. Click Attach Drawing. Navigate to the F4713 we finished before. Click Overlay then set insertion point is 0 for X, Y, Z. Set scale is 1 for X, Y, Z. Click OK and close the XREF Palette Drawing Explorer. Open Setup Piping Rules and match the piping rules in the image below. Apply Size Rule is Show Options. Apply Specification Rule is Show Options. Apply End Type Rule is Automatic. Apply Pipe Length Rule is No. Apply Weld Insertion Rule is Automatic Butt Weld and Socket Weld. Apply Gasket Insertion Rule is Flange and Clamp. Apply Bolt Insertion Rule is Flange and Clamps. Apply Trimmed Elbow Rule is No. Apply Pipe Healing Rule is Automatic. Apply Branch Table Rule is No. Apply Flange Insertion Rule is Automatic Flange Weld Neck. Apply Bolt Hole Orientation Rule is Automatic Two Holes. Apply pipe end prep rule is no. And others are default. Click apply then close. Click spec view. Choose setting. Click view 3 1 level tree with less categories. Setting spec is 150 main size is 4 inch reduction size is 2. Setting line number system is on for static size spec. Category is size service count spec. Click save and close. Right click on size and put 4 inch. Right click on service and put CWR. Right click on count and put 1590. Right click on spec and put 150. Now we will add one flange to this nozzle. Size of nozzle is 6 inch. Locate the flange weld neck component from the spec view palette and click on it to select it for insertion. Right click then choose node. Hover the mouse over the nozzle until you see the appropriate snap point. Click selected nozzle size to correct the size of flange. Even though the size was set to 4 inch on the spec view palette, CADWorks prompts us to adjust the inserted flange size to match the nozzle. This is because our apply size rule is set to show options. Double click the placed flange and change for inch to 6 in the line number field. Click wireframe to see the gasket. Repeat the last step for gaskets and bolts attached to the flange. Click OK to finish add a flange.
Now we have finished modeling add a flange with XREF file. Thanks for your watching.